Hey friends. That guy that was some hard space ship breaker. Thanks for watching my playthrough. Uh last episode we ranked up. So oh what is this? This negative three fifty five. Oh, is it because they uh is how like bumped me up? Well, no, I was I was ranked eleven, then I went to twelve. I don't know. That's weird. Uh, anyway, <laughs> yeah, we ranked up and unlocked a an ability to salvage more th new things. We're gonna work on a electrical control unit, I believe, today. Learn how to pop some fuses. Uh, hopefully, we'll be able to cheese it like we did the previous ones, where we can basically deconstruct most of the ship before we finish doing the tutorial part. Yeah, let's get into it here. Good morning, shipbreaker. Your theta wave levels are high. Please administer two caffeine pods before starting your shift. I don't think we have anything to do here. Nope. We still need a dampener found in a forklift. Let's check our equipment. Mm, probably should repair that. 66 MP or MP doesn't matter. We're looking at the tokens. That's what we need. Yeah. Reduce the durability drain firmware update that optimize the control of internal mechanisms. Say the same thing. Reducing the rate at which the tool degrades to the use. I feel like I've read that before. A firmware update. Anyway, order LT broke. So let's get into doing the tutorial. Talking over each other so much. This is a cut point three. I can't do it. I think that might be a uh, detonator charge thing. We'll have to upgrade that. It's not going to disconnect. So, are we going to. I don't think we have the tokens for that. I don't know how much it costs to unlock. everything no okay get to these at least I guess detonator charges the timer is going unlike the other tutorials I think maybe hmm, maybe that's like a story driven way of like not letting you to cheese it anymore because Hal just wants you to learn yourself and get get it done 
That's interesting. enough LT to unlock the detonator charges. I don't know if there's another upgrade for a cut point. Interesting. Like here and shit. Ooh, ooh, I'll piece it immediately. All right, we got any air controllers in here? Credits awarded. Does not look like it. All right, where are we? There's a data drive. Got some more lore to pick up, go through. More posters. What is that noise? Is it the ECU? It sounds like it's like right here though. figure out the air situation we are in an air situation right now I 
I don't see... Disconnect this because I still have to deal with like power in the back end, right? What? Wrong way. back here too before we lose power right airlock depressurizing cutter there's five minutes remaining in this ship get in while we're getting good we were out So, I think we're good now to work on these fuses, which by the way is what I was hearing. <laughs> That's not the way I want to go. why I was injured. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Well done, Cutter. You disconnected all the fuse. Now the power generator should be safe to extract. Give it a go. Am I ready to extract it? Like, is it going to spark up and shit? Does it have like a meltdown? No. Thankful. Well done, Carter. Rest should be a breeze. Just place it on the old bar. I I don't think I can remove these yet. These are like the fins on the front. That I think the ring I think the the ring is connected to these fins too. Uh, 
maybe? No. I'll check it out. Just, I just disconnected the fins from the ship, but they're still connected to the ring. So I can't take the web apart. Yeah. Well, we did reach a salvage goal. So that's good. We have enough tokens for the detonators. Shift is almost over. Is the inside or the outside? Yeah, it's the inside. Okay. 60 seconds left to wrap things up, Carter. be it for the shift it sucks that like there was like overlapping stuff happening there i couldn't really pay attention i wonder if it's no well maybe i don't know what happened there i was i was thinking maybe because like i leveled up but when i leveled up that unlocked the the tutorial maybe there was just more story to be told and it triggered the tutorial at the same time. Well, we have 24 tokens. Hopefully, we can afford detonator charges. Otherwise, we are kind of boned. Overall, a pretty good shift, I would say. Reactor write off, Riley Keaton mechanic. Well, Cap, I figured out what your problem is. You ain't gonna like it. Looks like it's the sarcophagus. Thing's got hairline fractures down its belly and it's leaking radiation faster than anything I've seen in 40 years of flight. A new reactor, oh, that's gonna set you back, I don't know, 50,000 credits? Oh, that's nothing. And then there's labor. Now me, once I have the darn thing, I can get her done within 72 hours if you want my crew working fast, working regular, six days, most likely, to get her all in and tested. But you have my guarantee. It will last you twice the original manufacturer warranty, and that is the best guarantee you're going to find in all of Mars Village. Anyone else? Either going to string you along and ask for more, or give you a patch job. You don't want a patch job, unless you want some of your crew to sprout any new appendages. So let me know what you think, Cassandra. You know how to get a hold of me. Thank you. 
<laughs> oh my god, it cost 120. Oh no. Well, can we do cut grade here at all? No, just range and range. Heat capacity cooldown, durability drain reduction. Well, I have to grind for a little bit. I don't know if I want to go back to that ship now. I mean, there's, yeah. Might be able to do the back end. Yeah, I was not ready for that at all. Hmm. That's unfortunate. Why can't I just find some tokens somewhere? <laughs> just laying around a ship. What do we do? Can I go back? Yeah, I can. Okay, let's see what I need first. Because I already forgot. Dampener. That's right. Looks like you're trying to operate on your ship. Would you? Hmm. The hazard seven. Maybe six is my max right now until I can get. Yeah, it's gotta be. The seven another Atlas Nomad cargo hauler. It's got a dampener. Let's do it. That just, I just gave away a ship that was like had a lot of money worth left on it. Oh well. Quarters have air and nothing else, it seems. That's good. That means. Well, I guess. Depends on if there's a air control unit in there or not. Pretty cool. <laughs> the 
just wasted a lot of time probably for something so meaningless. <laughs> And it's busted. Airlock pressurizing. do this how do I do this right Airlock depressurizing. oh that's it that should be it let's check it out cool yeah all right These were like what three hundred dollars? <laughs> I chased it down for three hundred dollars. Let's just see. I mean, I'm playing a dangerous game, but whatever. This all happened because the grab button is the same button as my push button. <laughs> I didn't look around like a dummy. I 
can't use my momentum from that either. <laughs> this is worth a shot. Why can't you just pull him straight out? Come on. It is working. Why were you red? You broke. What the heck? All right, whatever. This one should be able to... Ray. Salvage goal met. Rewards will be paid. Bane. Salvage accepted. Credit applied. I have this weird feeling like it's going to get wedged to where it can't go in. It's going to block everything. Looked like I was struggling, but I don't feel like I was. Salvage secured. Credits deposited. Tether supplies are low. Thank you. 
for that update. Always worried that's gonna happen and it finally happened. Jesus. So miffed about that. <laughs> Not even funny, dude. Alright, this goes to the barge. You come with me. Hopefully the other one doesn't I I, I don't think I can fix this. The uh gravity well. Yeah. Gravity well is way too strong. What happened, dude? Oh, that makes me so angry, dude. <laughs> uh, all right. So I think that's two shifts, right? What do I have to do for today? Let's finish this up we still need 120 tokens for those freaking explosive charges by the time we get the tokens for that we'll get like another promotion hello ship breaker 9346-52 links would like to share the following inspirational message make the most of your shift by fanning the tiny sparks of effort into flames of profitability. We had a data drive, didn't we? <laughs> Lots of test text. Terra Firma magazine, October 2301. Quarterly Heritage Literature Company. First found on Big James. Some great diving running around. There's a great, there's some great diving running out of Alabama and Georgia over the former Sunshine State. Not much of Florida has gone to, to deep water, so there's some really beautiful dives through Miami, Fort Lauderdale, and my personal favorite, Sarasota, with her white sands. You've just got to keep your eyes open for jellyfish and bull sharks, but really, it's not. Florida without a little danger. Captain Liam Freddy. Yeah. Driving across the North Sea Lake is one of the great journeys to make in Europe. You've got the freshwater lake on one side and the old North Sea on the other. The dams were built a couple of hundred years ago to hold back the tides that threatened Europe, but they were incredibly well maintained even today. There are too many lives on the line in Denmark, Germany, and the Netherlands to let the dams fail. Shipwright Frank Meyer Smith. Wicked jelly not text. As a jelly man, you're going to you're going wherever the blooms take you. Find a path and follow those beautiful blooms of jellies out to the horizon until your hold is full. This year we we've been running ninety eight percent or more capacity on every return trip. More jelly in the ocean than ever before. Captain J.D. Asmajan. I probably butchered that. Hey there. Still need a dampener. Alright. Our equipment. Anything need to repair. Rusters we could probably do another one more shift on. Alright folks. 
I think that's it for me. Um, but yeah, this is Hard Space Shipbreaker. Thanks for hanging out and watching. If you enjoy it, please hit that like button. And if you want to come back, hit that subscribe button and be notified when I get new episodes by hitting that bell. I feel like one of the <laughs> one of the YouTubers that do this. Put one of those movie posters up. Oh hey, do that. And then this one. And we can change this one too. Chips. Yeah. <laughs> anyway, thanks for hanging out. Hopefully I'll get some uh, new episodes out to you soon. I'm trying to get like a bunch of them and then upload them like once per day. We'll see how it goes though. But yeah, thanks for hanging out. Catch you again soon. Bye-bye.